Now, to aid in Colorado's comeback, one Colorado lawmaker is looking to add jobs while also helping our state's forest. Congressman Joe Neguse has proposed a new conservation corps, similar to the one that helped build Red Rocks Amphitheater back in the 1930s. Jeff Todd joins us live in Jefferson County tonight. And Jeff, they're hoping by looking back, we might find better ways for uh, Colorado's future. Karen, Congressman Neguse has really been pushing this in Washington, D.C., but the strongest remaining roots of the original core are right here. As this sign says, it's workforce for saving places. So the idea is to get Coloradans, have them work in some of the most beloved places, and hopefully teach them a skill so they can build a career. Those were the barracks that housed the men. The Civilian Conservation Corps uh, played the critical role in building this architectural masterpiece. Uh, I think a lot of folks aren't aware of uh, the deep history. Each building has 28 windows. This site is now home to Denver's mountain parks, but the history is everywhere. So these are the original floors from 1937 to 38. The Corps built much of Red Rocks Park. Shelters, roads. They did forest restoration projects. And now Congressman Joe Neguse wants to bring the idea back. It's a long time coming in terms of getting some of these projects funded to employ a new generation of folks to work in our public lands, address high unemployment in our communities, but also uh, to address the unmet needs, as I said, in our public lands and public places. $10 billion has been proposed for a core to get improvement projects funded and people hired. It's very labor intensive, but th there's such a desperate need. The hope is getting people trained to provide them a career path in improving Colorado's trails, parks, and forests. It worked before and it can work again. This is a top priority and we intend to fight as hard as we can to make it a reality. Some experts say that this is the best preserved site of any core dating back 85 years. So Congressman Nagu says that he is hoping to actually have a field hearing here, bring legislators from all over the country to show them what a lasting legacy this could leave. We're live in Jefferson County tonight. Jeff Todd covering Colorado first.